Hey guys, I'm back again with another video, and today I have three DVDs to show you. One I picked up today, and then the other two I picked up probably about a week or two ago, or this past week or so between. I believe I purchased them on two separate days, but I can't remember. Um, so yeah, I also picked up some books and stuff too, but I'm going to leave this up to you guys before I show the DVDs. Do you guys want me to show you the books and stuff I get? Um, because I don't think many people really care. They just care about the movies and stuff and DVDs and stuff I pick up. But let me know if you guys really want to like see the books and stuff. I'll start showing, uh, showing them again. But for now, I'm just going to show the DVDs and Blu-rays, VHS tapes, and stuff like that. And possibly games. Um... So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get this started. Um, first up is a DVD, that one of the DVDs I picked up, and that is Mask. Um, this was, I believe, based on a true story. Um, I've seen the movie. I watched it online on the web, on some kind of thing, and uh, it was pretty good. I mean, it wasn't amazing or nothing, but it was pretty good. And this is the director's cut, and I'm not sure if this is... The version I watched or not, I'm I'm not sure, but um, yeah, this I believe I believe this is not on uh Blu-ray. I searched it up, but I couldn't find too much about it on uh Blu-ray.com. I just basically saw the DVD, so I'm pretty sure there's only a DVD for now. But there's the disc. But yeah, pretty good movie, kind of long. Um. Two hours and seven minutes, but you know, it was a pretty funny, fun movie. Or like, in interesting movie, not funny. Um, next up is one I did an unboxing for, but I never uploaded the video. And I'm just gonna show it like this, unless you guys really want to see the unboxing. Um, but that is the Berenstein Bears, the complete collection. I have volume one, the Treehouse Tales, volume one, and... I never got Volume 2, and I believe Volume 3 was coming out. When I bought that, I did not know this was out, and if I had have known this, I would have got this instead, because I think the three volumes collect up or collected in this, like, one uh, disc DVD set, so I would rather have them like this. But there's the back, and unfortunately, my box is a little cracked down there, you can see. But I, I was going to switch it with the other one, but I decided not to. And I am also selling that on eBay, so if anybody really wants to uh, buy that or something, I do sell certain things on eBay. Um, So, just let me know and I can link my uh, eBay account in the description or the comments. But yeah, there's that. And Disc 5... Unfortunately, no episode guide um, on the front or episode list or anything. But um, the first two discs are the um, volume one of the Treehouse Tales. So I'm assuming disc three and four and possibly five combine up the rest of the volumes. But um, yeah, would have liked to have like an episode guide or something. To go by because I just have to put the discs in to like see what they are, but it is what it is. Um, I may end up printing out a thing or writing down the episodes for that since there's like 80 episodes on there. Last up is probably my favorite thing that I picked up, and I picked this up today, and that is the Loud House Absolute Madness, which is season two, volume two. I have all the Loud House DVDs they've released, so this is the newest one. I have all four. Um, pretty cool show. A lot of the episodes I've seen are just on these DVDs, because so I don't really watch it on TV. But, you know, I do really enjoy the show. And I did not know if this was going to be at my Walmart or Target. Um, I was going to get it the day it came out. Um, but I ended up not being able to, and it's been raining in my area for like the past week. So... I didn't get to do that, and I went to Walmart today, and I couldn't find it, and it ended up being placed really randomly, like, down the aisle, not like with the new release sections, section, 
and uh, they only had two copies, so I picked the one that was had the better slip cover, obviously, and bought this one. But yeah, there's the back. Here's the inside. They always have really cool artwork and like inside artwork, which is pretty cool. And I do like the show, and I know they're like on season four, I believe. So hopefully, if people keep buying these, they'll continue making them because I do enjoy collecting these. I'm always pretty excited when a new one comes out. So hopefully, they continue getting made, unlike the Rugrats seasons, which unfortunately I believe got canceled or something. But, um,. Yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. Be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.